In VRAR, it's important to obtain feedback from the virtual world. Current equipment in the market focuses mainly on visual and audio feedback. But without tactile feedback, we still cannot actually feel things with our hand. Haptic gloves nowadays are typically bulky and tethered by a bunch of wires or cables. They also require cords connected to the external power supply. To make the touching experience more vivid and immersive, a novel tool to overcome these hurdles is an urgent need. It should be wearable, flexible, thin, lightweighted, wireless, and can universally fit to any user, by personalized encoding the tactile information. And Electro-Tactile is a great solution to meet these needs. Here we present an ultra-thin, soft, and skin-integrated wireless Electro-Tactile system, that is, WeTac. It's composed of the driver unit part, and the hydrogel-based electrodes hand patch, which make the system flexible, cable-free, and wearable. By elaborated design of microelectronics with soft elastomer encapsulation, the driver unit is greatly reduced in size, driven by a small battery, capable of Bluetooth communication-based control by a mobile phone, and compatible with wireless charging. It can output controlled electrical current through up to 32 independent channels to the whole hand via the flexible hand patch. However, the sensitivities of hands among people vary largely. A same stimulation may be felt in different ways. The threshold is related to gender, age, and even jobs. Among a hand, the fingers are much more sensitive than the palm. Meanwhile, electrical parameters also matter. Higher current intensity leads to higher sensation levels, but as stimulation frequency grows, thresholds for the same level also increase. With these personalized threshold maps acquired, we can encode any tactile information from pressure amplitude into a set of stimulation parameters. With this strategy, WeTAC could be applied in efficient human-machine interaction which helps the user perceive the tactile information on the robotic hand simultaneously. Virtual tactile information like an AR mouse running on your hand could be felt vividly, with the current controlled and monitored by a mobile phone. In VR environments, WeTAC could help the user feel virtual objects when touching them. For example, when grasping a virtual tennis ball, the collision between your fingers and the tennis could be detected, which triggers the stimulation on the five fingertips. Similarly, Tactile feedback could be designed into a strong but short warning signal to alert the user when touching something dangerous in VR, which can trigger their fastest instinctive reflex. We believe that this advanced wearable electro-tactile feedback system could also assist the development of other fields in the future, like remote control of robotics, sensory regain from prosthetics, catastrophe alerting, skill training or remote education, etc. Thanks for watching.